Could we fly like Talos said? Talos is dead. How did he fall, Father? You killed him. No! No! Father! It was a game! We were playing at flying! You killed him! And in his rage, Daedalus flung his blanket over the bird. They struggled and fought until there was a terrible crack and the great bird's neck snapped. Ah, now your brothers will come for you. And we'll have feathers enough and wings enough. Father! Wings of our own. Do you hear me, son? Wings of our own. We'll fly. Love him, Daedalus. Love him to death. The next morning, Daedalus trapped more birds and stole their feathers, found a swarm of bees and stole their hive. He stuck the feathers to spines of wood with beeswax, moulding each feather tip perfectly together, carefully copying the wings. More feathers, father. Oh, leave it. Leave them. I'm sorry, he's only trying to help. Yes, but it's too important. If it weren't so important... If I weren't so clumsy, if I was Talos... Now, my son, please, please listen to me carefully. You always think I'm not listening, but I am. I really am. Fly behind me and keep close. Don't fly too high or too low. If you fly too low, the sea spray will weigh down the feathers. If you fly too high, the sun will melt the wax. What did I say? If I fly too high, the sun will melt the wax. You're squeezing me. We're not saying goodbye, are we? Daedalus clung to his son on the hill. Then he kissed Icarus, and it seemed as if some great bird was feeding its chick mouth to mouth, as birds do, or that Daedalus was willing his knowledge into his clumsy son. Then they turned and ran to the cliff edge and up, out, and away, away from the lands controlled by Minos, flying. did not stay close. As the earth shrank beneath him, he beat on, up, past clouds, past listening, past promises. Icarus flew on alone, higher and higher and higher, towards the sun. And bead by golden bead, the wax started to melt. Icarus fell, fell down and down into the sea that bears his name. Icarus! He died? He died. That's terrible. Why did he fly too high? He promised he wouldn't fly too high. I think when Talus dropped from the sad heights above Athens, Icarus was already falling, as if a single thread held them all together. Talus fell, Icarus fell, Daedalus fell.